Hello and welcome everyone back to some more Spyro 3. Alright, so today we're going to be going to Haunted Tomb. Ah, yet another daredevil adventurer has come to rob our catacombs of loot. Let's just hope you're made of tougher stuff than the last guy. If you can survive the trials of our catacombs and answer my riddle, we will give you a prize befitting your efforts. Here is my riddle. I am a vessel without hinges, lock or lid. Yet within my walls a golden treasure is hid. What am I? Let's see. A vessel without hinges, lock or lid. Within my walls a golden treasure is hid. Um, I have no idea what that is actually. An egg, I guess? Um, I don't know. A tomb? I'm not too sure. I'll be honest with you, I have no idea. I'm not the best with riddles, let's just say that right now. So I believe you do actually need to get rid of these in some way, but I can't remember how you do it. I think you get like a super breath fire power up and that, that does it or something. I don't know, I'm, I'm still trying to work out the riddle. It's kind of annoying me now. It's like really bugging me. If I remember correctly, this is level... Yeah, there it is. See that right there? Yeah, that's that's basically the same as uh, Crystal... What was it? Crystal something. Crystal Islands, I believe the level was called. That little slip and side level we had to do. It's going to be exactly the same, but much worse. Alright. Oh, no, no, no. You need to... To get rid of these guys, that's what you need to do. I don't think they last forever though. Yeah, see? My god, this level is actually one of the hardest levels to go for. And I know I said that like so many times before, but it actually is this time. Okay, these guys you have to charge at. I was not expecting that, but okay. I'm so glad I got like the extra sparks little health thing there, because if without it... I don't know if I'd be able to do these last couple of levels, like, as easily, anyway. No, 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 get it, get it. Can I shoot him from here, or...? I'm not sure if I can. God dang it! Oh, no, no, no! That was a bit close. Right, get this one, get this one! Oh, why is this so difficult? Camera angles, what are you doing? Alright, he got me, but I got him, so that's fine. Okay, right, I'm gonna need, I need, I need one of those things right here. There we go, that'll do. It <laughs> Just give me a whole new life and also a new Sparks, you know, that works out great. Now, I'm not sure if we do actually have, like, the, the next level thing because, I don't know, I mean, I got hit four times there and nothing happened, so I, I'm not sure. I'm not 100% so sure on this yet. I mean, it said we did, but I'm not sure. I wonder if we do or not. Oh, I know what we got to do. So it drops one of these. We get one of these. And then I believe we can take out these with this. There we go. Nice. All right, so what I'm actually going to want to do now is I'm going to want to get another one of those. And go back so that I can kill the other mummy's tombstone as well. Like so. I'm not actually sure what that switch down there does either. Like there was a switch just behind me. And I'm not sure what that does. Alright, come on. Charge this guy. Get rid of this. Get the gem. And then we'll keep going. I think you only have to press that once as well. But yeah, there is a uh, there's a switch just around here. I'm not sure what it does though. This one. Uh, that do anything of importance? Oh, I think it just opened the door. Okay. Well, never mind then. Okay, that mummy tombstone is apparently jumping towards me. Jumping with joy. All right, throw your balls. Throw your balls. Come on. All right, I'll take that. And I'll get rid of that. Kill that guy while I'm at it. And now I need to kill this guy. So, alright, throw another one. Throw another one. It's like catch. 
It's like playing catch with your dog, only it's a lethal bomb. Alright, you can have that, because I don't want it. And then I'll steal all your gems, because that seems decent. I really, really want to play, like, ever since I started playing Spyro, I've been wanting to play Crash to, in Crash to Insanity. Just simply because Spyro appears in it. Like, no reason more than that. What is this for? Oh, I should have kept the bloody, uh, explosive ball things. Now I can't get rid of them. Unless I go back, but that's just, I don't know. The effort is so much, it's just unnecessary. I don't know if I want to or not. I think I will. You know, I think I will. Because I can tell they're going to be a right nuisance if I don't, so... And also, like, you know, I'm missing out on gems, so it's probably better that I do anyway. Where am I going? This way. This way, man! Alright, up, up, glide, round, up. Get the bomb. Alright, wait for them to fall. Oh, there's a new life! Alright, I want this... I'm going to have to come back for this as well, which is kind of the annoying thing. Now go, 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 There we go. Right, that's one down. And now I just need one more. Then I should be good. And then I should be able to move on, because I believe that... I think it's only these two enemies in this level. I'm not sure if there is a third enemy. I'm getting like loads of butterflies for some reason around this area. I keep forgetting that door's closed as well. Hopefully when we complete the level they, they won't be closed anymore so we can just go about the level freely, but I'm not sure on that. Kill that guy. Alright, press the switch and then go! Run! Okay, we made it through, we made it through. That's always a good sign. And... oh, okay. I would have missed that one if I didn't turn around. Now, I don't really like the falling level part of the falling level parts. The falling rock parts, because, I mean, even though you get to see where the shadows are falling, it's still a little bit hard to go through these places, because you've got to be extra, extra, extra careful. Okay, I just swallowed one of them. I didn't even know that was there, but I'll take it anyway. I thought it was a gem. Alright, I don't know what this does. Okay, I literally have no idea what that does, but that's fine. Get rid of that. Fuck off, mummy man. Oh, okay, I get it. So Sparks just stays gold, basically. That makes more sense. Alright, you take that. And you can take a similar beating. Where has he gone? There he is. And I need this guy's balls. Come on, throw one, throw one, throw one! There you go. Where is it? There we are. Oh, no, no, no. Get out of it. Yeah, yeah we got him. Look at that head rolling. Keep rolling, 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 rolling. And there's the egg. <laughs> you know, half of these dragons were born crying. I mean, either they have really bad parents or it's just a bad sign. I don't know. Get out of it. Oh, I see. The switch all the way back here opens that door. Are you kidding me? I've really got to, like, run for this, I think. All right, let's go. Let's go! And there we go. I made it. One too difficult. Oh god. <laughs> that was a little bit close. Oh no, that was close because I got hit. All right, I'm gonna take this, and then hopefully that comes in handy, like that. You know, I'm getting a lot more of these 25 gems, like the, the gems that are worth 25 points. I have no idea if that's just because we're in the last level or what, but I don't know. Maybe it is. The fact that I can face a sorcerer is already just, you know, is already a great thing. I find that so funny though, because like I've just been going through the game trying to get as many eggs as possible all the way through, and you could just complete the game right now if you wanted to, but I'm not one of those people. Alright, let's see. Get rid of this guy. Uh, let's see. There we go, there's the guy. That's the one I want. Alright, give me a ball. Take that. Oh shit, I missed. Give me another one. He's more like an assistant than an enemy in most cases. Oh good. I forgot he didn't get hit. Alright, I'm going to take this guy out as well. And then I'll do the little side quest thing while we're here. Might as well. Alright, get some of these gems. Get the extra life. 
And then let's go into this little side quest thing here. I don't know what this is either. Oh god, no. The first round of the annual demolition hovercraft competition is about to begin. There is room for one more contestant, but you'll have to answer a riddle to qualify. The riddle is this. If one dragon can lay one egg in 12 years, how long would it take for 100 dragons to lay 100 eggs? 12 years. Very impressive. That is correct. Good luck in the demolition hovercraft competition. Circle for straight shot, square for lob shot, L1 and R1 to dodge left and right. Okay. Just make sure they work. Alright. Okay. Well, this should be... Alright, I remember this being so, so difficult. Like, it's one of the most difficult things ever. And it seems that it hasn't really changed too much either. I think if you hit all the pots, you can actually, you know, you get... Oh my god. No, no, no. I think if you hit all the pots, you can actually get a, uh, what do you call it? You can get uh, another dragon thing. I don't know how you get back over there. I think you can get over these little platforms, but I don't know. I can't remember how you get there. Did I get him? Yeah, I got him. Nice. Well, well. That was a fierce battle indeed. Please accept this prize for winning the first round. All right, MG. Oh, we can juggle. What do you know about that? A baby is born with the skill of juggling. You may now enter the championship round. However, this is an exceedingly dangerous sport. Might I suggest you quit while you're still in one piece? Now nah, bring it on. My, my. Such a brave reptile you are. But you'll need much more than bravery to win the championship. Alright, so it's the same controls. But basically what my plan is, is I'm just going to stay here. Unless I, can, I know that I can get to one of those platforms, you know? Because... If I remember correctly, there is like one right behind there somewhere. But I can't remember... Because I remember this being extremely hard, like with 10 people, it was hard enough with 4. So, you know, it's it's not going to be an easy championship. I just need to try and get that guy behind the pot right there. Would that hit him? Come on, one of them's got to hit him. Come on. Get him. Because I think once you go past the line, there's no... Oh, fuck this. You know what? I'm just going to go for it. Seriously? One hit? Holy shit. Alright. Alright, alright. Chill out. Chill out. Chill out. Alright, get out of it. Get out of it. Get out of it. I just need to take out one of these, like, little platforms here. And then from there I should be good, you know? Because usually they can't hit you from round here, you know? So if I just do, like, if I just do that, maybe... Maybe everything will be alright? I don't know. Let's try this. Did that get him? Come on. Really? If I just keep firing, I wonder if that will... Yeah, I got one! Alright, good, good. Alright, now I'm a bit nervous. Because I know... Oh my god. Can I get that guy? Yeah, I got him! Nice! Alright, good. Okay, what I want to do, or what I want to do, is see if I can get that guy as well from over here. I think I can. I think that one will hit him. Really? Come on. I just, I really don't want to go into the main arena, because if, as soon as I do that, I'm going to get completely obliterated. So, it's better if I just sort of like stay here, try and wing it. Come on, you bastard. Let me hit you. Let me hit you. 
It keeps moving like left and right. It's really annoying. Yeah, there we go. I got him. Nice. Alright, I should be able to hit that guy from here as well. Yeah, there's one. Alright. So that's six out of ten. Now we're down to about four out four left. Alright. I'm not sure I don't think I have any health left, so I'm being really, really cautious now. But bear in mind, like this is actually one of the hardest mini games in the entire Spyro game, so you know, anything can throw you out. Anything. Like, you know, you could be focusing on one guy and suddenly another guy comes from around the corner, you know? It's not easy. Come on. Yeah, there we go. I got him. Alright. There's two left. Two left and I don't actually know where they are. So, you know, this is making me slightly nervous now. Is that one guy behind there? Or... No? Alright. I'm not sure if there's one. Like, I think there's two over there. Yeah, there is. There's two over there, I believe. But then there's also a thing where I can get a butterfly from. I'm going to try and hit that. Did I get it? Oh, I think there's a butterfly over there as well. God dang it. Alright, you know what? I need to try and see if I can hit this guy from like round the corner. Maybe. Like corner shot this guy. Did I get him? No, I hit the bloody pot again. I wonder if I can just get him through the... Did that hit him? Oh, come on. Really? Come on, something's got to hit this guy. There we go! Now there's just one left. One left. But I have no idea which platform he's on. Which is making me extremely nervous considering I don't think I've got any health left. Alright, I think that's him there. Alright, come on. Where are you? Give me something. Just a little more to the left. There we go, we did it! That was indeed a battle for the ages. You're the first dragon to win the competition in over a thousand years. I proudly present you this year's grand prize. That was the prize last time, only it was called MJ, not TJ. The fuck is that? Alright, well, I'm going to actually split the episode in two for this level here, so hopefully you enjoyed the video. If you did, please leave the video a like, and subscribe if you haven't done so already, and we'll continue through this place next time. So other than that, I hope you're all having a great day, and all that's left to say for me is... Farewell!